Hello all traders. I like to share with you a few clips and trades shared with us by our consistent traders who graduated for a while and uh, they trade uh, e-currencies and CFDs and this trade was sent to us by KF who's constantly trading Nasdaq in form of CFD. So you see he took two position of point two lot when the Nasdaq was going up to test this area in the macro we are in downtrend but in the reverse of this we see medium risk possibility to get uh, money and scalp this area so as you see this channel here uh, and the middle here is taking this wave and swing at the right area with good stop loss and and target which is actually more than middle because he's advanced trader and his strategy is to trail the profit and get more out of the each swing so let's see his clips uh, so initial stop loss with this entry is here is trailing up to this area both positions to try to lock these profits here uh, and then his target is in here which is easily achievable so uh, he sent the clips up to this area and I don't have any more a video from him but essentially I think he reached the target 13580 yes I think here you see 13580 was reached here and therefore he got very good um, not only high percent win of 80 90 percent but also very good risk to reward ratio because the risk was this much and the reward is at least few times more so thanks KF for sharing this nice trade with us AP and other uh, consistent traders uh, share two trade with us one is on euro chf pair this is his ma macro chart that shows breakout here of the channel and potential to go and touch this area so then with 30 minute the structural chart we see this move as a downtrend uh, and then in the trading chart of five minute we see opportunities here to enter uh, and because of good momentum he entered a little bit late but it's still acceptable in the overbought area and with the target which is trailing and aiming way down here to targets very low area so, so let me fast forward his clips to see how he managed this trade because his advanced trader is not exiting at the middle channel here instead he's trailing to see if the trend run line that uh, goes down breaks and then close the trades manually so he updated his trend line here again looking to see if the uh, next swing resumes and also he adds often position in each swing so i think he may add more position here if he sees potential uh, yeah, he updates here. If the sellers come back and this level get rejected, he can add position or just trail the rest of this position and move them down. Okay. Let's see how he manages this trade. Anyway, he's in profit so far. Okay, he added at this point two more position. 0.01 and all these positions now let's see the sellers came back he's in profit here and here and now if this trend line breaks he exits manually that way he gets more uh, out of these runners because these runner okay now close down and probably will close much more so I think that's the end of his clips and as you see all this entry here and 
in here are in big profits and which is around 25 pips so far these trades are in profit and that was his first trade on forex pairs that AP shared the next trade the next trade uh, is on Nasdaq when uh, and on 26 we see it's coming down in this area this this wave here so we already entered if we look at this channel here and then again accelerating here he, he see breakout at this level and then entered here so four hours chart macro 30 minute downtrend also one minute downtrend and this is high probability trading area so he's now moved a stop initially from up here to here so he's in profit if the price comes back here but he's looking to see how much he can get maximum out of this trade either manually close or put targets now because he see another swings added to the position here these are in profit this one is now in profit with the stop loss of this year stop loss of this trade already so let me see he's changing his music background oh good good okay trailing some of the profits from initial stop loss more close to break up this TP is as you see close to here so either reach the TP or close it manually okay let's see the momentum is not good he, he will close it now manually more and more position closed closed okay let me see this last part of clips okay so essentially he closed most of the position here with very large profit from up here and some here to this area this is around uh, 200 points on nasdaq which is very nice and significant chunk of this wave thanks ap for sharing these nice two trades with us uh, ren also shared this uh, clip with us that's showing his shorting the nasdaq uh, on 30 minute structural five minute and one hour sorry macro structural and trading charts and looking for opportunity to enter here so let me see his clips so as you see this is 30 minute chart showing downtrend and is accelerating now he's waiting for the pullback here to get some uh, some short position here and now on the, the smaller chart he has to go find entry some pullback in this area so on this five minute chart he's waiting for pullback to enter short position is completing his uh, pre-market checklist and market checklist at this time there's no news volatility is okay so then he enters all of this and then goes to session checklist for the volatility and news that there was nothing and okay so then he's, he has to go for the first three algo and look for pullback so now he sees this uh, retracement and pullback on one minute chart and entered here with the target here which uh, reached the target let me see he's entering his uh, record of the trades and then the target which is now filled yeah and this is amount of profit he took so thanks everyone for sharing these trades and thank you for watching and let us know if you are if you have any questions and uh, have a wonderful day